Two games left then for Villa and the Premier League is looking as tight as ever in the race for Europe. In terms of fixtures then it doesn't get much harder than an informed Liverpool team at Anfield. Liverpool who have only lost one game at home in the Premier League this season to Leeds, randomly. Seven wins in a row in three clean sheets in a row for Liverpool, but much like them, this game is huge for Villa. Are we outsiders for Europe as it stands? Probably, but we've been in similar positions before. So it's uh, all for play for still. I think so. Do you want to bet against us? Go back about a decade, we used to have a pretty decent record at Anfield, picking up a fair few wins. That lime green kit, that away game sticks out for me. Tell you what we need today. Prime Gabby, Prime Benteke, Prime Andy Vyman. We need them all back. Anyway, last away game of the season. Probably one of the hardest away games you could have. But keep the faith, trust the manager and up the villa. Morning, Simon. Good morning. I've gone with the, what year is this? This year, 99, 2000, is uh, it? Yeah, kind of. Yeah, 98. Kind of? No, we wore it for two seasons. Oh, did 98. we? 98. It's yeah, I thought I'd wear it. I haven't, I haven't worn this for a while. You said to me last week that you weren't feeling confident and then you tweeted that you've got a feeling. I don't know, I just, it's, look, it's a massive game. It is. I think, I think the one thing for me is that I don't like Hesper to kick off earlier. I like that, I like no, it. I, I wish it was at three o'clock because effectively if they win, we yeah. should be all like, despondent by half two. So, well, we'll, we'll win as well. Huge game. I feel like we can do something. <sighs> Bring it on. Welcome to Liverpool. It's just as sunny up here. Absolutely lovely. Pub is literally just over there. I believe Anfield is just over these trees here. Simon, can I talk to you about your shirt? You oh, Bosco Balaba. Bosco Balaba, when will you play? <laughs> After getting turned away from the first pub, we've uh, come to a Spoons, which is actually right by the Everton ground. Look at this. We've got our beers. We've got a nice little opening of some Liverpool main roads. Not too bad at all. Take this. So you've got, what, an Iceland. You've got an Aldi. It's the, it's the delights of the Northwest. Loving it. Bertie, Liverpool away. What's your score prediction, mate? I'm going to go. Liverpool will score, but we'll win 3-1. Three, 3-1. Three, You're confident? A bit. A bit. Good lad. Give us a lot the Villa. Up the Villa. Spurs, Brentford. Huge game. Come on, Brentford. Son, big game. Brentford are losing as it stands. Yep. What do you reckon today, son? Do you know what? Liverpool's defence are weak as anything. I reckon yeah. a 1-0 sneaky win. 1-0 sneaky win. Clean okay. sheet. Clean sheet. Come on then, Villa boys.
that Brentford result is massive, absolutely massive. It's all on us now. Brentford winning 3-1 is huge. It's going to be tough, of course it is. I'd take a point now because of Brentford winning. 2-1 Villa, why not? Keep the face, Simon, what do you reckon, so? It's giving us a free hit, hasn't it? An absolute free no hit. No free hits. Ah, it's a free hit, man. Come on. They've lost a free hit for us. 2-1 Villa, come, come on. on. Come on then, Villa boys. Number three for me. Very, very good. It went through that action pack first half, hasn't it? But yeah, like brilliant. Like, controlled it, controlled it. We have, we've had a lot to do. A, a decent amount of position of the ball coming here. We controlled the ball quite well, I thought. Yeah. Like, yeah, really good. Obviously missed the penalty, which is really unfortunate. Not a great penalty. But reaction was good. Yeah, reaction was really good. We reacted, uh, but then we've had some very questionable decisions by the referee. And, you know, like, so it's coming to the hard time with 1-0 lead. It's been brilliant. Yeah. And, uh, and, and, We'll keep going, that's what we need to do. The ref is doing his best, we won't talk about the referee. But, do you know what, you can't really ask for a better position, can you? 1-0 up at half time, we're playing well, Martinez hasn't really had to make a save. You know, Moreno, Ashley Young, come on boys.
That's where we're going next season. Bring it on. Well, that's that. I think you were just, you were just saying there, Si, like, yeah. what, a point's fair? Point was fair after today, wasn't it? You know, they, they didn't have loads of chances, though, did they? I mean, Martinez didn't really make any real clear good saves, did they? Still a well worth a point. 100%. Absolutely. 100%. And that means it's in our hands. In our hands next week. Uh, it's obviously Tottenham losing today to Brentford. In our hands. All we have to do next week is win, and we are guaranteed. Well, next week will be just a crazy atmosphere. The sun will be shining just like today. We've come away from Anfield with a point. Absolute huge. Tune into the podcast that me and Simon will do tomorrow. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Leave a like on the video. What a day it's been today. And up the Villa Boys. See you next week. Come on.